What's up, everybody? So, you know, people get too obsessed with comparing themselves on social media, TikTok, whatever. You know, these people that are showing their highlight reel and you're just, you get depressed because you're like, man, these people, they're just hitting home runs all day, right? Just every post, just ding, 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 just hitting it out of the park, right? Their finances, their looks, their camera angles, I mean, everything, everything's on point, right? Like they just, they're smooth operators, right? And what people don't realize is that's not real life. Yeah, of course, some things do go right. And some days you do wake up feeling awesome and you're like, man, I feel great. I'm going to get after it today. The sun's shining. I got some good sleep. I've been sticking to my diet. I've been sticking to my workout. But some days, man, you're going to wake up and you are going to be exhausted. And you are going to have to literally pull yourself through the workout. Like it's like drudging through mud. Like it's just, ugh. And I've been there. I've had many nights after work where I don't feel like training. But something happens when the blood starts flowing and the endorphins start flowing. As soon as I get done with the workout, I'm almost in a state, an elevated frequency. I see things more clearly and I'm able to separate myself from the situation and observe it. And that's the natural high of working out because you earned your dopamine. You didn't just get some cheap dopamine real quick, like scrolling or skipping the workout or over consuming calories, right? Those are, those still give you dopamine and they put you in an elevated frequency, but it's very temporary. So you get a little elevation and then you dip below baseline. So then you, you're, you're on this constant roller coaster of emotions and you're basically a nervous wreck. If you're a guy, you don't want to be a nervous wreck. It's better to be, you know, you're not feeling the best all the time, but you're not having lows. You know, you're just kind of like, you know, you're like, yeah, I got this. I got this. You're glowing. You're glowing. You're not like manic and like, oh, I'm having the best day ever. But you're not like, oh my gosh, I don't know if I can carry on anymore. You know, and that's, that's where you want to be. You want to be stable, cruising, glowing, content. And just this morning, I woke up and I was like, I do not feel like training. I do not have energy. I do not feel motivated to train, you know, when it's like, and that's just what happens. And then tomorrow could be a perfectly different day. Tomorrow I could be super motivated, super happy, super, you just don't know because your emotions are like weather. They, they come, the clouds come in, they rain, and then it goes away and the sun comes out. So you don't know. You have to weather the storm and you have to weather your emotions. So what I did is I grabbed this little bench right here. I set it up. I grabbed my dip bar. I just did uh, like six sets. So I did six sets of 12 of dips. And I did six sets of uh, 15 with my feet on the bench going down to hit the upper chest. And boom, I called that a workout. I checked it off. It wasn't like what I had planned and it wasn't the best workout in the world, but um, compliance is the science. So I complied, I adhered to the program. I didn't do the best workout ever. I substantially reduced the volume, but so what? I completed the workout and I walked outside for about a mile with my shirt off. So I made sure to get my vitamin D. I started my day off this morning with protein, with uh, two scoops of whey protein and some vat pasteurized milk, which is a healthier milk source, but that's a topic for a different video. And yeah, I feel pretty good, feeling pretty good. So not every day is gonna be a home run. Some days it's just gonna be a little base hit. So don't get stuck in the matrix of believing everybody's hitting home runs every day and everybody's feeling awesome every day except you because they're humans just like you. There's ebbs and flows, there's elevation of frequency, there's decrease of frequency. So don't get too caught up in that. And just remember, everybody's going through fluctuations and it's normal. And you're not your anxiety, you're not your depression, you're not your highs, you're not your lows. You're you. You have a spirit and it's really you inside there. It's not your anxiety, your emotions, who people tell you are. You can create who you want. You tell yourself who you are by following through with your daily habits. You don't fall to your, you don't ascend to your dreams, you fall to the limits of your habits, of that 
non-negotiable things that you do every day. So remember, not every day is a home run, but make sure you're getting those base hits. Make sure you're putting points on the board.